100% Chelsea, Chelsea 2, not on and Forest 0. Uh, first thing you've mentioned, you said you want to get the new shirt out. It is a very lovely shirt, I will say that. Yeah, I do, I'm, I'm a classic. It's an so a name. Another one of the many shirts I called the Cannaville shirt because of the era. Mm. Well, yeah, let's talk about the footy. So, yeah. <laughs> so uh, it's, they, they always say football's a game of two halves. I think, I think we saw that today. First off, we were, mis, we were completely misfiring. We, we, it looked a lot like Forrest could take it if we carried on the sec in the second half. Glad I wasn't the only one thinking yeah. it. And it's typical, I mean, with Chelsea, there's always a the thing that a lot of us know, we don't do goodbyes very well. So to see Fab <laughs> so Fabregas getting the chance, name up in <laughs> lights. <laughs> right, you got five minutes, go around the pitch, see you in a bit, all right? No, Fabregas getting the chance, name up in lights, thinking, oi, oi, we actually have a fairy tale goodbye. And then one of the worst penalties I've seen. <laughs> In a recent memory. But no, no, fair, fair play to him. Cesc Fabregas, he has been a phenomenal player at this club. He's he's gonna go down as one of he's gonna go down as one of the greats. Some I'd say a cult hero, I wouldn't necessarily say legend, but people are gonna argue about oh, that. Cult hero. Yeah, definitely definitely a cult hero. I mean, look, he's a he's a player who's well respected, world renowned, should adored by Chelsea fans, adored by some Barcelona fans I know, they adore him. Arsenal fans, if they have a brain, they'd adore him. <laughs> I mean, so, yeah. Yeah. I, I, I think a lot of Arsenal fans yeah, now have yeah, kind of yeah. they got either being butt hurt because they realised it was Arsenal Wenger's yeah, fault exactly. they didn't resign. It was their own fault that Cesc Fabregas. It's, as far as their own fault, Cesc Fabregas didn't retire in red. Uh, I mean, I know he's not retiring; he's leaving. But I mean, he's he's had a lot of great memories at the club, yeah. like nearly breaking the assist record in his first season. He was. He was phenomenal. What do you think about him? Obviously, the move announced is potentially going to be Monaco. Yeah. I, I think he's going to do bits over in France. I think I think he will, to be honest, especially because Monaco, right now Monaco need it. Monaco need to Monaco need to sort their stuff out. They're looking like a team with a, in a, in a lot of danger. And I think Cesc Fabregas could be that man. Mm. I mean, got to help his boy out, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and also yeah. Let's. But yeah, I was, I was well happy to see Fabregas getting clapped off the pitch. I was happy to see him come back round and get clapped off again because he's. We've had a lot of great memories. But yeah, moving on from Cesc Fabregas. Callum Hudson Odoi, we cannot sell that man. And, and, I, and I say man, he's a, people call him a boy. He's stepping up to the plate like a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a man, but when people say a boy, he's not a boy, he's the boy. Yeah. He's, he's, yeah. he's our... He's the boy and he's becoming the man at the moment. If it's not Hazard, it's Hudson Odoi for me to be the man at this club. Mm. Hudson, like today, he... <laughs> let's, put this, let's put it this way. He made Murata look clinical today. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny because it's true. Yeah. It's, it's, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, credit to Hudson Odoi. He was phenomenal. Credit to, to Morata as well yeah, for finishing. Credit, yeah, exactly. Credit to Morata for the two goals.